What's up, everybody? Um, I haven't taken a video in quite a while. Um, a garden tractor repair video, anyways. So I thought I'd show what I got going on here. It's my son-in-law's John Deere, and um, what happened was the circuit here on this. I think it's a 68, if I remember. I can't. I can't quite remember. I'd have to look up the tag again. But anyways, what happened was um, this pigtail here got shorted out. I mean, it was fried. Electrical tape, I mean, a whole nine yards, and it got hot. So I bought a pigtail for like an old uh, Chevy truck or something, um, but it wouldn't quite fit on the stud. So what I did was I redid this wire um, to be able to put a nut and a lock washer on. And then um, just kind of swapped the two the ends or well put a new end on took that off put it on this one so this comes from the positive on the solenoid here the, your your hot wire comes off of there onto the bottom stud and this comes out of your wiring harness and then I tried to match the wires red red um, anyway so you connect those two and then the key switch is new my uh, son-in-law's dad put a new key switch in and look nothing so i thought okay maybe it's something else the pto um switch here has been notorious for having issues in the past tried that i jumped the solenoid make sure the solenoid was still good it's fine what i ended up doing um was hold on here it's kind of hard to do this one-handed but uh i ended up taking and just uh, bypassing the circuit altogether. I'm using a cheap set of alligator clips I got from home, um, Harbor Freight and um, make sure I'm not touching anywhere so don't short out. I got a rig going on here so I'm coming right off of a battery. I know it's not good to have a battery on the ground but I'm not leaving it on the ground it's just there temporarily. So um, anyways we're hooked up positive ground all that good stuff now watch what happens so now we know that the circuit is bad so I'm gonna get this replaced and uh, should fix the problem so just thought I'd show that little trick if you can't figure out what's going on this could be possibly your problem here and you can buy this at uh, Napa I think it's like a 20 amp circuit um probably about any other part store will carry it um i'm probably going to end up getting it from my local uh, kinderville auto parts on main street because uh i've been dealing with them ever since before i could drive and my late dad did my uncle uh they're just good people and he knows his stuff so anyways this is on a 68 john deere peace